To make the clock, I used foam core. I freehanded the shape of the clock cut to exact pieces. I cut three pieces that measure three by three and one piece that measures three by five, which I ended up not using. You're also going to need a box that measures about eight inches long and I recommend the depth of two to three inches. I painted all my pieces light gray. I then came back using a sponge and I dabbed on a darker shade of gray to give it this look. I then took a 12 inch cake board and painted it black. The next step is optional. I took these white pearls and I hot glued them to the front of my clock. I then took a silver metallic pen and I shaded in the pearls and this is what they look like before and after. These are the ending results. Next, I took one of these wicker wreath forms and I spray painted it black. I then took a 12 by 12 white scrapbooking page and I free handed the clock. I then took that sheet and I glued it to the 12 inch cake pan and then I pierced two holes on the side on the left and on the right using my paper punch and then using zip ties I attached it to the wreath form. Using my Cricut I cut the number 0 and 5 and a spider. I attached it to my 3x3 squares. I also cut days to Halloween and I attached it to the front of my clock. And then attached my 3x3 squares to the front of my clock. I then cut out some bat wings and a one inch circle. I attached the one inch circle to the center and then I attached my wings. I then took this empty ribbon spool and these four foam blocks, painted them gray. I glued the blocks together. I then used this box that measured eight by three, painted it black. To assemble, I glued the blocks to the ribbon spool and the ribbon spool to the box. And then I added hot glue to the foam block and then pressed my wreath form into the hot glue. I then added the back panel and then I added the front panel. Then using these glitter foam balls, I used the orange balls and I randomly placed them on the clock. And these were the ending results. Thanks for watching. Bye.